Hey YouTube, this is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists from around the world, both established artists and non-established artists. And I promise you that you won't be disappointed whatsoever. So why don't you come along and join me in discovering amazing, talented artists and bringing it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now, my next reaction of today, we are going over to Ukraine. And this particular artist, Valia Levchenko, um, singing um, Koloskova, which is Lullaby. I have yet, I'm not going to, I want to subscribe um, to her channel live to you guys she's only ha got 308 subscribers um this song was premiered on october the 20th and it's got now 30,311, i believe um views so i am going to press subscribe right now and i have highlighted the notification button to indicate to you when her in, indicate to me when um her next uploads will be now i want you to read something that's in her description page um it says this song uh is 22 stories of ukrainian women who escaped from the war or decided to stay um due to the war many women around ukraine had to flee with their children not knowing um, where they would spend the next night. This represents by the sound of new visions of the traditional Ukrainian lullaby. Um, okay, uh, you know the traditional lullaby. I'm not even going to try and attempt to pronounce that because I know I'll get it wrong. Well, uh, it's got Kol Kolo uh, Vikon, but I don't know the K H O D Y T. Don't know how to pronounce that. And it goes, the dream passes by the window. The song by um, Valia Levchenko, who also created the concept and for the past three months managed to manage the production of the image for the music video, what we're about to watch. Um, here is the real faces of the women and children who had to flee the war. Uh, she said, I wanted to show and tell the real stories of people um, who are called, who are now called refugees. I don't even like that word, to be fair. Um, Valia uh, Levchenko, together with the Humanitarian Foundation, Ukraine Trust Chain, uh, we created a fundraiser to support the small volunteer organization. Help in, is it Machen, Machenvenko? I don't know how to pronounce that. Makachevo. Chivo. There you go. Uh, which managed a shelter for more than 400 people, uh, for elders, orphans, um, from Donskek. Um, dimp, I, I can't pronounce that word. You know, what? I need to get my ass over to Ukraine, right? So I can see these words be accompanied by amazing Ukrainians saying, Uncle Momo, this is how you pronounce it. <laughs> Do you know, Uncle Momo, this is how you pronounce it. So I can't wait for that day. I really can't. Um, so the funding is ordered to buy warm clothes, food, hygiene products and for the winter and prepare shelters. Winter is coming and it's going to affect everybody from around the world. It really is because of what this conflict had. This conflict has got a massive chain of effect with the economics, especially with the oil. And, and there's a massive oil war about about this. Uh, I know that um, Putin has... No, I won't, I'm not going to say Putin. Somebody... Yeah, has blown up the um the the tunnel or the the tube that's underneath the the sea that's linked to the, uh, many many European countries that su that supply them um oil you know gas so to speak so someone's blown that up so there's a massive um gas leak in the sea I think there's three of those pipes that's been um, that's blown up so. And now the, the 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 prices of gas is is gone up. Um, you, uh, um, the Arab Dubai they're refusing to produce more oil, um, so they're going to produce less oil, and um, so they're going to price up, uh, rise up the prices of uh, gas as well. So it has a knock on effect, and so we're going to see how this winter is going to uh, affect the war. So that's that it goes in here it goes 
I'm going to read more of this after, after that because I'm blabbering on. This is going past five minutes. So, look, without further ado, you know what we're here for. Great vocabs and a damn good video audio music. Can you dig it? Six point five million. We heard it song, Kolovikon, and Rimota, Koloplata, Pitaitsa, Sandrimoti. Don't cry, Maurice. Don't put a more, not you a tea. So that was Velia Kovaskova. No, that was the song um, Kovaskova, which is Lullaby. But that was Velia Levchen Levchenko. Is that how you pronounce her name? Let me know about that. Pow! I wasn't ready for it. I wasn't ready for it. I was not ready for that. I am right now highlighting uh, some information that was down below because wow, 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 wow. I was not ready for it. Oh my gosh. Um, right, so what uh, what was underneath that information was basically in Ukraine, but, so what she's done is, she's writing it in, in Ukrainian, and then she's re retyped it in, um, in English, so that's what that was, um, but underneath it, it's got Valentina, Valentina was born in the former Soviet uni um, Union behind Iron Curtain, but grew up and built a career in uh, independent modern Ukraine, um, so is that is that Valia or is that or Valentina? I, I I don't know. I need you guys to help me up on that. But also in the description page underneath the in Instagram, it's got the full stories of the women from the videos are there. So if you want to look at the full videos of those individual twenty two women, then I leave that uh, I leave that details there as well. They've got the links for the donation. Um, uh, there as well, and actually, I'm gonna highlight this part because this looks kind of somewhat different, and then I'll go straight into the analysis. I just want to find as much information as possible, guys. 
the video indicated due to Russian aggression had to leave the Hans, not knowing they've spent. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah. yep. And that's the same thing. Right. Um, so the, the, the song is a version of the traditional Ol, um, Oli or Oi, Oi Kodi Son Koli Vikmom by Vali Levchenko. Right, so that's what I've got there. I, the, my pronunciation is absolutely rubbish. Wow, about the visuals. And like she said, she done the visuals. She's done, she done the edit in the, the process to that. That had such an impact. Crazy impact. It was going, my heart was going boom, boom. I can feel it. I was feeling it. Boom, 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 You can't, two things that you put in front of me that I will absolutely melt. Children and their mothers. And you put them in any kind of situation where they are stressed. It could be small stress or big stress, it doesn't matter, as long as they're, if they're stressed, and I'm weeping. I am, I'm like, ah, uh, you know? Cause I remember like, you know, me, I'm the oldest in my, in my, uh, in my family. And I remember my mum, you know, you know, struggling to be who she needs to be. You know, and why it's being chaotic around it, and me there, and I'm just looking at these, you know, these amazing strong women who went on the road for a number of days, number of uh, hours. There were 22 days. There was 24 hours. There was there was some crazy numbers in there that shows you the strength and the power of women. Full stop. Yeah, and in this day and age where it's been predominantly powered by men, yeah, let's not get this. Let's get this. You know, go through the history. It's predominantly powered by men. It's unfortunate that it's only kind of like now, in our era, that women are gathering are seen gathering strength or while well, they've all, are seen gathering strength not saying only they just start they've always gathered strength they've always been the strength in the core yeah but i'm saying men have only now seen it as a as a population and it's due to unfortunate events when men are away or where men are dependent on the unconditional energy that women have that power through any kind of situation that is presented to them. Regardless if they power through it, crying or in pain, anything, they power through it because they know what the end means. In situation where men will maybe give up, women will certainly pers persevere. And just seeing the women and their children to bar combined and the look of what I saw with the females in there was a ro was roses, the beautiful women, but they had thorns. Like I will prick you if you try and come and ruin my path. I will go for every. I will go to all destinations to reach to reach there. And I've got my child on my back. Oh, uh, you know, it's just it speaks so much volumes. This this music video, it speaks so much volumes. And I had to hold it in so much uh, to watch it. I really did. And I don't know how you guys are going to feel when you see this. I'll leave the original video to it as well. So you can watch it without me blabbering on through the video. Uh, I, I don't think I was talking as much, to be fair. I was just in awe, I was just in awe of what was happening, what was presented to me. I'm so fortunate to see this video, stumbled upon it, so I can share it on my channel. And for that reason... I salute you. Wow.